Hi, I'm Austin Tribble with Be Heard TV, and we're at Aspen High School in Aspen, Colorado, where the Maverick Business Adventures is going on right now. And I think it's pretty cool how they're teaching us how to become entrepreneurs in our own way and what inspires us to make our own business. We got some really cool interviews with Yannick Silver, the founder of Maverick. So go ahead and check it out. Facebook? Facebook? Facebook. Yeah. All, right. All right, now All right. check this out. Right here. Eamon here. He makes money off of you, and he has all your information and knows all of your friends. <laughs> uh, I have about, um, about 40 employees worldwide, and we're looking to do eight figures this year. I run a couple of websites. One is thequickhousebuyer.com, and one is fireyourbossin 90 days or less.com. Go to college if you can. It, in grad school, statistics are always going to be on your behalf. Income is tied to education. <laughs> I have, a, I have an internet company that I started back in 2000, literally. That sounds like an infomercial. Woke up uh, 3 o'clock in the morning in my one-bedroom apartment and started this little website called Instant Sales Letters. And within uh, four months, I was doing six figures online, and it's, it's grown from there. And it's uh, all together, my internet companies are a $3 million business with uh, zero employees except my wife. So I asked myself the question, how can I create a fully automatic website that makes me money while I sleep? and is an incredible value to other people. What made you want to tell youth about uh, becoming an entrepreneur? Yeah, that's, uh, that's one of the, uh, there's three facets for Maverick, for Maverick Business Adventures. One is I've always been into every incredible experience you can imagine. I've ran with the bulls, uh, bungee jump 450 feet, just recently went skydiving from 30,000 feet. And uh, so I knew there were other business people like me who wanted to do some fun stuff like that, but were too busy working. Mm -hmm. And so I wanted to take them out of their element and then combine it with business. But at the same time, a lot of entrepreneurs want to give back to, to youth, to future entrepreneurs, and tell them that there's other paths that they can take. And so that's the third component. And I've always done that in a small way, but I knew that together, as this group evolved, we could do it in a much bigger way to educate um, at youth risk, uh, different, different young aspiring entrepreneurs, and as well as uh, contributing money to, to some causes that help that. Education comes on different ways. I've never stopped my education. So are you saying that I could start right now and try to make my own business? Yeah. Okay. No, I'm saying just start small. I'm saying make your first dollar. Um, the, a lot of, one of the quotes I like is, it's the process, not the profits. Mm -hmm. So ultimately, we want to be millionaires maybe. Ultimately, we want to maybe be mega millionaires, uh, but you start with making that first dollar. You start small, but for 50 bucks, 100 bucks, you could start a website tomorrow and figuring out a cool thing that, that might not be out there already. One of my philosophies is go the opposite direction than competitors. Well, thank you for your time. My pleasure. Uh, it was really great to have me interview you. It was a, my pleasure. So. Um, you're watching Be Heard TV, and this has been a Be Heard production.